Hi, my name is Zach. I'm one of the technicians here at the Path Bike Shop in Tustin, and today I was going to be going through my 2021 Transition Scout that I just finished building up. So I bought this as just a frame only and did a full custom build up on this. It's very similar to the Scout GX build, but I did a couple other little touches on there that I really like. Um, so we'll kind of start from the bottom up. So this bike is rolling on some freshly designed IRC Tonkin tires. These are a 2.6 width with an extremely thick casing because I like to destroy tires and destroy wheels. And for the wheels on there, we have some custom built Zip 30 Moto rims on DT Swiss 350 hubs. These were custom built in house by our wheel builder, Mike. He is other no otherwise known as Wheels. Uh, all his builds are really awesome. So these are super sweet. Um, we also have a GX Eagle SRAM drivetrain on there. Super durable, um, but great value. For the rest of it, um, so let's do talk suspension. Um, I have a full SRAM and RockShox build on here. So we have a RockShox Super Deluxe in the back and a RockShox Lyric on the front. For this build, this normally comes as a 150 travel front and a 140 travel rear. But the way I have the bike set up is that it's 160 front with 145 rear, just to make it a little bit slacker than normal and to just get a little more travel for some like bigger bike park stuff. Um, also on here, we have SRAM Code RC brakes. These are the biggest brakes they make. And those are paired with absolutely massive 220 millimeter brake rotors on there. Uh, those are the biggest ones SRAM makes and I'm surprised they fit on this bike, but I like big brakes, so we had to squeeze them on there. Uh, for the rest of the cockpit, uh, it's a mix of one-up components and spank. So I have a one-up 210 millimeter dropper post. Uh, one-up components, 35 mil rise bars, uh, spank grips, spank stem, and then uh, actually I have a WTB Silverado saddle on here because that's what fits my butt nicely. And let's see what else we got. Uh, King Creek 40 series headset, um, really nice Synchros bottle cage with multi-tool built in. Always got my one-up EDC pump on here. Always nice to kind of keep those, uh, you know, when you get flats and stuff like that. So, yeah, uh, I'm five foot nine, and this bike is actually a size medium. Um, so I used to have a size large Mega Tower, but the way this bike is set up, um, running a little bit shorter was actually a really nice kind of change for me. And the bike is super poppy, super playful, and probably one of the most fun bikes I've ever had. Thanks for taking a look.